morning guys welcome to vlogmas day four um i'm up much much later than i planned today but i think that's because i'm a little bit tired still from our weekend of fun and frolicking got some filming to do before class this morning and i've got vlogmas to edit and i've got this video to edit as well um and various other little bits and bobs um yeah i've just been lying in bed for like an hour just trying to <laughs> gather the energy for my day but i'm gonna get in the shower now so chocolate first what have we got here number four Ooh, a little swirly one right guys number four here we go Um, this is the one I was burning at the farm over the weekend with the girls and it's delicious it's kind of like sweet and spicy all at once right I'm gonna go put these two from the weekend with the others it's taken me absolutely ages to get ready today but I've got myself a smoked salmon bagel before I begin you can see my lipstick on it of course that means I've got a dog so I'm all fin finished finished filming you guys. This is what I'm wearing today. I'm not actually entirely sure on my outfit today. I don't know if I like it or not. I haven't decided yet. But um, I think I'm going to take this lip colour off because it's kind of annoying me a little bit. Um, I feel like it's going to annoy me in class. And I'm going to start worrying if I've spread it all over my face. So I'm going to take it off. Yeah, I've just got to get ready to go to class now. I've got lots of stuff to do after class, but um, I think I'm going to just take my book, do some reading on the tube. Um, I've got about 20 minutes before I have to leave. So guys, changed my top. I'm wearing my little unif crop. This is my outfit. Changed my lip. I think I've got a Kat Von D Lolita. I can't remember which one it is. I don't know if it's one or two. I think it's one. I Yeah, I'm going to go now. It's time for class. It's not exactly what I like Calling home a sofa bed Lying wide awake at night Because I'm hooked on what you say When you hold me I'm slowly Hi guys, so I got back from class absolutely ages ago and since then I've been faffing around um, doing various bits and bobs. I had some dinner. What did we have tonight? We had some risotto, um, which I forgot to film. But also I've just been doing loads of little kind of YouTube bits for jobs and stuff. But I still have lots more to do before the day is out. But before I can do that really, I've got to clean up because this room is driving me nuts. I haven't unpacked yet since the weekend. And I cannot get anything productive done in here today yet because I have not cleared up and actually just I'm just gonna take something off in my bullet journal to make myself feel a bit better so yeah my next thing is to get this room cleaned so I can have a bit of desk space I'm finally done with the clearing up. It took absolutely ages because I had to put all the washing away and all sorts. But I'm going to do some editing now. So, guys, I am one video down. It's almost 2 a.m., but I think I'm kind of determined to get the video that I filmed today edited as well, just so I can tick everything off my list and, um, I don't roll anything over to tomorrow, which that's what me and my friends call it. We call it a rollover when um, you do something tomorrow that you were supposed to do today. And I don't want to roll over because I have lots more to do tomorrow. But whilst this is exporting and stuff, I'm going to go and 
sort myself out a snack because I'm kind of hungry. So guys, it is 20 past three. I have just finished doing my other video. I am so tired. I'm waiting for it to export, so I'm gonna go take my makeup off and then I'm gonna get myself into bed. I think I'm gonna head into a library tomorrow. I'm not sure which one yet. I'm gonna meet, friend, meet my friend for coffee and then I'm gonna go to the library um, because I have a heck of a lot of the fifth season to get through before Thursday because I haven't really read much today apart from what I read on the tube which was quite some time ago. Bye! Good morning you guys! Welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. Um, I am in a good mood this morning because I managed to get everything that I wanted to done yesterday. It just feels nice um, even though I haven't had much sleep. I did have about five hours I think which is all right worse. I really want my chocolate from my advent calendar so I'm going to go and eat that right now. Oh this one's very fancy. Right guys number five looks like a perfume. Getting good at doing this with one hand again. Ooh dosin that's a nice one. I absolutely love these perfumes. I think they're such a nice size because they last for ages as long as you don't use them like literally every day. If you just want a little spritz of something here and there. God, what's that smell? Do you know what? I'm going to have to look it up anyway. So I was going to go to the library today, guys, but I had a big dip in energy. I'm shining when I'm with you And we ain't playing hide and seek I got a different game instead I'm building cities out of sheets Hi, So guys, I've been reading the fifth season for a few hours. I've got lots more to get through. That's my like main task for today is to get through as much of it as is possible. I'm enjoying this writing in the notebook thing. I think it's working out for me quite nicely. But yeah, I'm working in bed today because I'm feeling a bit tired and lazy. I thought I'd take a quick break from reading um, and just have a little chat to you. I am on page 232 so i've read about 150 pages but i've still got a lot of the day left so i've got i've got high hopes i think it's about i think i've got about 220 to go so hopefully i can push on um i'm really enjoying it i love myself a fantasy as you guys know um and this one is a particularly like high quality one like the world building is um very thorough and it's like got lots of new ideas and it's a lot about the environment the style of it is a little bit strange it's not my absolute favorite style it's quite like conversational and almost a little bit too colloquial sometimes for me but i'm enjoying it um i really i like the kind of concepts in it also tattoo update my i stopped wrapping my hip tattoo um a probably on saturday i think um because it was driving me nuts trying to wrap this tattoo <laughs> um because of where it is it just kept coming unstuck basically and i think it was making it worse so i decided to stop wrapping it pretty much immediately started peeling um the one on my lower leg my hummingbird really i think is still peeling i think it's because it's like it's a dry area of my skin anyway but it usually just kind of looks a bit dry it tends not to peel um so if like i had a if i burnt my leg there which i never would like in the sun or whatever it probably wouldn't peel as quickly as if i burnt my hip which does occasionally happen the one on my hip is peeled a lot quicker it's still a bit dry but yeah it's all coming off pretty quickly it's healing pretty nicely actually it's been a weird one to heal because i'm sitting on it all the time and like 
it's kind of it was more uncomfortable after I got the tattoo than other tattoos I've had like it's a bit a little bit more sore and yeah I've been getting heart palpitations all day which I'm not a massive fan of to be honest some of them have gone on for like a few minutes and it's driving me a little bit crazy quite peckish but I don't think I can be bothered to go downstairs and get a snack um because I'm so lazy. I've managed to resist napping all day, which I think is pretty good going considering I've been working in bed. <laughs> Great. Are you, are you surprised to find yourself in this position? Oh. So, excuse my hair, you guys. I don't entirely know what's happened to it. But I've just had some dinner. Now I'm going to light my candle. Oh no. I've just put matches everywhere. Um, I am burning the one I got in day. 25 from my dipty calendar last year which i believe is called sapin or le roi sapin i'm not sure but i've been burning that one kind of on and off try not to get it through it too quickly because i do want it to last me a bit more of december because it's my most Christmassy candle really Hi guys, so it's about 1am now and I managed to finish the book which I am a little surprised at but also really really pleased about because I did not expect to get through 400 odd pages today but managed to do it. Um, I got, I got like seven, seven-ish pages of like written notes, I know eight, um, which is far fewer than I use would have written at the beginning of term which is good I'm not overwriting too much stuff and I don't think it slowed me down too much either but hopefully it will help me to remember some stuff for class um, and I feel like it helped to kind of solidify some of what happens in the book um, it wasn't wildly taxing of a read anyway so that's why I don't think it took me too long but it did have a lot of really interesting concepts like I said earlier big fan of it um I am desperate to get my hands on the next one so I'm going to order this is the first of a trilogy so I'm going to order the next two for me to read at some point I love days like today I love days when I have to take the whole day reading like it's really such a privilege like it just always makes me realize why I study because sometimes there are stressful times when you're studying and there's a lot going on and you have to write essays and stuff and that bit I don't enjoy so much but when I get a whole day reading here and there I'm just like I'm just reinvigorated by it and it feels like such a privilege to be able to do it and spend time on it and think about things that I never would usually think about and yeah I just love books Yes, and I'm pleased to have got it done as well because I've got lots to do tomorrow. Yes, I'm going to get myself to sleep. Bye. Good morning, you guys. Welcome to Vlogmas. I always said vlog day, but day six. I am just um, getting ready very quickly, so I'm going to talk to you whilst I get ready. I don't know how well you're going to be able to see me. Um, because I'm in a bit of a rush. I've got a hair appointment today starting at 11 and the appointment is with Bedhead because um, I'm doing a little bit of work with them um, do a little style for me which is exciting so maybe it's something I can wear to the Christmas party tonight because it's the Christmas the English Christmas drinks tonight which um, last time I went to one of these Christmas drinks as you may remember from Voltober it went pretty wild. Um, actually, no, that wasn't that. That one wasn't so wild. I did, I did come home at a relatively decent hour. But yes, before we can get there, I've got absolutely loads to do today. I'm hoping this hair appointment isn't going to take too, too long because I do have lots of other bits that I want to get done today. I quite like to do my theory reading for tomorrow before I go out. Otherwise, it's not going to get done. Yeah, I'm excited. I don't know what style we're going to do on my hair yet, but I'm hoping that they've got more ideas than I have because I am trying to get better with my hair um, and styling it a little bit more. But I'm a bit of a novice when it comes to it. 
that's what they're going to do today. They're going to teach me a style that I can then recreate. I feel a bit restricted fashion-wise at the minute because I'm still trying to use, um, to wear things that aren't going to rub on my hip tattoo. Even though it is basically done flaking now, um, which is kind of the most dangerous bit because you don't want it to like, you don't want anything to rub it whilst it's flaking so it doesn't come off too soon. But yeah, I am still trying to be a little bit cautious because it is only a week old today and it's not completely done flaking. I'm actually going to turn you guys off because, not because I don't want you to see me getting ready, but because you're running low on battery and I need to charge it before I go. Hi guys, so I just got out of my hair appointment. I just did a little bit of styling. I'm waiting for my cab because I am trying to be good with public transport and take public transport over cabs as much as possible but it would take me double the time for this specific location to get home um, not in a car so I'm just waiting on that now but yeah it's a little bit chillier than I thought it was so I'm feeling a bit cold season add a personal touch to your creations with this different so I just had a ramen which I haven't had for ages believe it or not I know it's hard to believe but I ran out of ramens like a month ago and I haven't had a ramen for a month so I just had one for my lunch and I'm gonna do a couple of emails now read my theory for tomorrow morning and then I'm gonna see how much editing I can get done before I'm hitting the town tonight um, which I'm excited for I think my hair looks really nice I never really do it kind of like shiny on top but there's something about it that looks kind of like 60s ish I don't know if you guys agree I had to order a new gorilla pod because my last one lost a leg I do have the leg I could super glue the leg back in but I sense that fix is not gonna last forever so I ordered a new one because I do use them quite a lot but the new one I've ordered I've ordered the one for SLRs so like much bigger cameras and it's even bigger than this it's absolutely ginormous um, but that's quite good because it gives you guys a much better view of me here so anywho I'm gonna stop rambling do some emails and yeah then do some reading I'm seeing pictures of my head with you I leave the lights on a different point of view so guys i am ready to go so guys look how hilariously huge this gorilla pod is it's enormous also it wobbles and i don't know whether that's because i've got a de defective one you're not really supposed to use it for carrying a vlogging camera around but i tend to use mine for that so i don't know if i've i'm using it wrong or what's going on but anyway i'm ready to go i finished my theory i had a 15 minute nap um so i'm ready to go for my tutorial tomorrow morning which is good um and this is my outfit i've gone with this kind of hybrid jacket coat situation because it will be of course a little bit chilly outside yeah i didn't want anything too precious because obviously we might be going out out and then i've got these trousers on because um they're quite nice and loose around the hips um for tattoo purposes and then i've got a black body on and just my vans as well to keep it nice and casual. So guys, I'm going to end this vlog here. Of course, I did not film any of my night out. Because I always forget as soon as I go out. Also, there's nothing ever to film because it's all of us just hanging around in like bars and stuff. Drinking. But yeah, it was a good night out. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And I will see you soon for another one. Bye. I'm shining